Good morning, everyone. I'm ABC 13 meteorologist Rachel Breyers, and here's what you need to know when it comes to our weather here in Southeast Texas. Today is an ABC 13 weather alert day. Rain chance is going to rise as we head into the morning hours and could impact your morning commute. Could continue to see these showers and storms throughout the day today, so make sure you take the umbrella with you and pack your patience. We will be looking at some wet roads and also the possibility of some street flooding today. And then we also could be looking at another round of heavy rainfall rolling in later tonight. We'll have to see how much the rainfall this morning works over the atmosphere. But through, I would say, the next few hours, the bulk of the heavy rainfall closer to our coastal areas, especially down to the southwest. But we also could see some isolated higher rainfall amounts even closer to I-10. And then as we head into tomorrow, it looks like if we do see that secondary round of heavy rainfall, we could be talking some much higher rainfall totals even closer to I-10. Now, it does depend on exactly where that low tracks, but it looks like it could track just to the west of Houston dumping some heavy rainfall even in the city. Our rain output, according to different models coming in for Houston, anywhere between one inch to over two inches of rain, but these are just in general. Could see even higher rainfall amounts than that. So there is a flood watch in effect through 4 p.m. today. It's possible this could get extended. In this area, three to six inches will be common with isolated higher rainfall amounts. So our flood risk for today, slight in the yellow area for most of southeast Texas. We have a moderate risk that's a level three closer to our coastline. And here's what's actually causing it this area of low pressure. It's going to continue to drag in more moisture throughout the day today, as well as going into Saturday, keeping our high rain chance in the forecast as we head into Friday and Saturday. Eventually, we'll start to see those rain chances decrease early next week.